So into Photoshop, let's open up the ACR window. This is Filter, Camera Raw Filter. And you know you have all the same um, sections here that you have in Lightroom, just a slightly different layout. So let's get the presets in. On this little vertical menu here, you click on this little two circle, one opaque, one transparent presets. You click on this and we want to import our presets in. To do this, click on the three little dots and select import profiles and presets. And then you will locate the LSP uh, Mini Christmas Magic presets. You just double click the zip file. <laughs> it's saying this because I've already done it. But if you haven't already imported them, they will come up here as the LSP Christmas Mini Magic Lightroom and ACR preset. So you can go ahead and open this up and you can do exactly the same in Lightroom. You can hover over until you find the perfect base, the perfect um, tweakers, the perfect shading, everything um, that you want for your image here. If you skipped ahead to watch the ACR part uh, because you don't lose, use Lightroom, what you can do is go back and watch how these are edited in Lightroom because the principles are the same. Now let's go and get the brush in as well. You have the Lightroom Glow Brush, you also have the ACR Glow Brush because they're, as with Adobe it likes to use lots of different formats, the brush for ACR is a different file format. So I'm going to come off presets, just come back onto the sliders for now here. Now to install the brush, it's a little, little bit more complicated than in Lightroom. You have to actually go into your folders. So um, you need to go, if you're in Windows, let's do that first. You need to go into uh, Windows, C Drive, which is whichever is your normal drive. Users, your name, app data, roaming, Adobe. And then you scroll down and find um, Camera Raw. And in Camera Raw, you have a local corrections folder. So what you can do now is you can go on your downloads. Let me just find that. And you download, you click on the um, LSP Glow Brush for ACR.xmp. And you can copy and paste or drag and drop this in. It's asking me to replace because I've already done this. Okay, and once that's in there, you hit close and you can go on your brush you can select brush it might not show until you restart acr though and from your brush preset where it says preset you can scroll down and find the lsp glow brush for acr and here you can change the size or you can scroll your mouse up and down you can use the square bracket keys feather keep it at 100 percent i would if you want that nice soft glow the flow if you want it to be very, very solid, have it 100. If not, bring it down so you can brush over a little bit more. The density is kind of like the opacity in Photoshop. So if you bring this down, it's going to be a little bit more of a transparent effect. So I'm just going to click on the candle here and you'll see it's added a glow. And you can also change these settings here if you wanted to. Added a candlelight glow. If you want this to be calmer, you can take the flow and the density all the way down make it nice and big and you can add just a general glow to the background by painting this over. You can hit create new mask, brush, from the preset drop down, select the glow brush, make flow and density down. Just bring that up just a little bit. You can just play with these settings to get the best one for you. If you want to take the brush off anything, hold down Alt on your keyboard and you can remove this from anywhere. For example, here we can just rub it out if we need to. So that's a little way of using the brush in ACR. But if you're using um, Photoshop anyway, remember in the Christmas Magic Actions, if you haven't watched the tutorials for those yet, the tutorials cover everything. You do have the glow brush in this set which is in the festive um sorry the sprinkle of magic you have paint on a glow and this is much more kind of um adaptable to your image here it's completely different completely different way of doing it but because you're in photoshop you can easily paint this on or off any areas you want and it will be on its own layer so you can also turn this on or off very very quickly 
So again, if you want to know how to use those presets in ACR, you can watch the Lightroom tutorial because the principles are exactly the same, the same as if you're using Lightroom Creative Cloud in Lightroom Mobile, the principles are the same. That was just how to kind of get them into ACR. So I hope you love using those bonus presets. Please do watch the tutorials for the actions and also the magic glowing overlays, the magic trails and all the other things that come with this huge bumper Christmas editing set. I'm Lauren, thanks for watching.